Welcome back to episode 20. We're working on uh, the Betsy Ross Jeep project over here. Um, last episode you saw us get this axle out of the donor Jeep out front there and bring it in here and then just kind of walk away. And it has been that way for a little while now. My work has uh, taken a lot of my time and continues to do that. It's okay. It pays the bills. That's how we can do this sort of thing. Um, and Mara understands that, thankfully. Uh, and she has a lot going on with her school. And um, all that stuff that's uh, keeping her time and busy. So the time that we get to come out here and work on this is pretty, pretty thin. And it's going to keep being thin and thinner because the next couple of weeks is going to be pretty crazy for both of us. So this is definitely going to be the last episode that you'll see in a while. And I don't know when you'll see it because I don't know when I'll give it up. So we're, uh, we're somewhere in late February, early March now, I think. Let's track of the time. We're still going but just a little bit at a time. Um, what I'm hoping to do in this video is just toss this back in the Jeep. Um, I really want to take it and strip it down and paint it and get it all nice and clean, put new brakes on it, and I'm going to, but for now, um, I want to get this back on the wheels so that I can move it around on the casters. Um, as it is right now, I can't move it because it's on the jack stands. So I'm going to have to take this axle back out or we're going to have to do some work on it after it's, it's in place. And that's okay. Uh, but if I get it on the casters and I move it around a little bit right now, we can get the interior opened up. And then I can tell Mara, go ahead and work on it while I'm not available. Um, and who knows, you might see some videos from her um, just filming what she does on the inside because our next step is to get get to turn her loose on the interior and get the carpet cleaned and all the stuff out of there and the seats out maybe and um, just let her go to town with that and uh, and and that way she has some work that she can do when I'm not here to help orchestrate it but in order to do that I need to get this back in and the timeline just doesn't work for us to strip it and paint it right now um, so that being said I'm going to get back to work and um, I'm going to try to get this track bar bracket cleaned up a little bit so we can put it all back in and at least have it in there and mobile and we will probably take it out again when we're ready to start working on it on the exterior again. So, thanks for coming along. I'm going to get this thing to come out of there maybe, you know. Maybe I take the whole track bar off. Alright, let's do that. Last week I asked Mara if she wanted to give up. She was ready to move on and just get a little car and she said no so I gave her the opportunity and said we can give up I also told her you know if you don't want to do YouTube videos on it we can we can tell the people on the nice people on YouTube that we're just gonna work on it ourselves and not share anymore and she said no she said she loved it and that, uh, she was glad that she would always have something to look back on you know, maybe if the Jeep didn't stay with her forever, maybe she would have this to remember. So we're going to keep sharing these things. And we really do appreciate you guys coming along for the ride. Because most of you are my family. 
and the rest of you, we're so glad to have you. There we go. I can use this guy. I can sandblast it. Ugh. And then paint it. And then reuse it. It's in good shape. And then I'll get a new end for this because this looks like a fairly decent track bar. Maybe. Yeah. We can reuse that. We'll put that aside. We don't need it right now. We'll put that in later when we take the axle back out to do uh, to do the tidying up of it. We'll leave the steering on here for now so that the wheels just don't go floppy. And then we'll put some uh, bolts in it and springs in it and that'll be enough to keep it up for now. Now, as much as I really do want to use those springs, possibly, eventually, for now, let's go see what we have in the pile out here. I think that looks a little bit more the right size that we're looking for. Let's see how they stack up to the giant ones. Yeah. I think we might go with the shorter ones for now. Maybe just a little boost. I know it's all coming back out, but I mean. We don't want to lose them. You know, we don't want to lose them.
looks like glitter. Can somebody paint those wheels glitter, glitter wheels? <laughs> Isn't that really funny? I was like, is it just me? Like, doesn't it? It does. It looks like somebody painted those wheels with glitter. <laughs> Where did they come from? They came out of the Jeep. I'm gonna have to look Pester Nate about that. Figure out where the glitter wheels came from. All right, Nate, where did the glitter wheels come from? It's on, sorry. Is this some glitter too? Yeah. It is! <laughs> they, they even paid the, the valve stem and the wheel weight. Four times four. She's back in the room sixteen wheels. It's not exactly homework, but it's something I was supposed to do in class and ended up being homework. Yeah. So technically it counts. <laughs> it counts. counts. Is that enough to get this hatch open? Oh, is it going to hold itself up? Be careful, don't trust that. Alright, well, that's enough to get around the back. Uh, we got the engine on the side that's going to be in the way. Uh, that can get around this side, that's okay. This way a little bit. That's probably good. <laughs> I think that was one of my favorite things to do when I was a kid. And Dad was working on a car, would be to play with the jack. So it, it just went up my heart to do And the boys both just come out here and play with the jacks all the time. Which, by the way, if you want to see the video where I unbox that jack, go look back in the playlist or my channel and look. I bought that jack new when that jack broke and the jack before it broke. I have a whole story. <laughs> oh, that's it for tonight. We got the axle back in it so it can sit on its own 16 wheels. And um, now Mara is going to start tackling the interior to get that cleaned out really well so that we can start taking the dash out so that we can start working on the heater core so we can get that out of the way and then we're going to start going back towards the outside and the engine and all that stuff but I don't know when that's going to be I don't know how long it's going to take for us to do that because my work has been is yeah, it's just schedules are I, I just don't have time in the shop for a while and I don't know when it's going to be and, and then I'm going to take some vacation diet days and get a whole bunch done all at once so, but I don't know when the next video is going to be. Hopefully you'll stick around. Hopefully she'll make something so that we can share that too. Um, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for coming back. Um, this is the 20th episode. Um, so maybe it's the last. Maybe we never, no, we're definitely going to, we're definitely going to keep yeah. making them. Just we don't know when. So check back often. And while you're waiting, if you want to, in the corner somewhere, there'll be a playlist. That playlist is all the videos that we've made up until this point. There are some things that you can look for, like stuff that we've hidden in the videos. That, um... Well, leave a comment below if you know what we're talking about. 
There are two things that I can think of, not three things I can think of. Two of them are audible, so I made noises that um, made it into the video. <laughs> and um, they're awesome and they're funny. So if you find those, let me know in the comments. Uh, also, there's another thing that's, that's visual that has been in all of our videos so far. And I'd love to hear if you caught them. So go check those out. Go back and watch them again if you want to. Just scan them or whatever. Like this video. Hit the like button if you like it. And come on back next time when we do more. Thanks again. We'll see you guys. Bye.